Hey everyone, welcome to another edition of Rumor Roundup, and as with the others, all the stories contained within this are to be taken with a grain of salt and haven't been officially substantiated, but are things that are being talked about in the world of F1 that may be interesting, could turn out to be true, or simply plain wrong. Without further delay, here is Rumor Roundup. In the aftermath of the 2023 Bahrain Grand Prix, there have been suggestions that the Mercedes are now the fourth fastest team behind Red Bull, Ferrari and Mercedes customer team Aston Martin. A new rumour has now come up regarding this. I'm your host Dylan Shelley and first up on Rumour Roundup, Mercedes willing to give fastest engine to Alonso instead of Hamilton. As per a report by The Objective, Mercedes are allegedly willing to take a few drastic decisions if they cannot improve over the next two races in Jeddah and Australia. Supposedly, not all power units are the same, with some performing slightly better than the other. It is understood that these power units are generally reserved for the number one driver at the works team. However, if after the next two races, Mercedes are still not in a position to win races, while Fernando Alonso is, Mercedes are supposedly willing to support him as much as they can. This allegedly includes providing him with the best power units that would otherwise be reserved for Lewis Hamilton. The report suggests that the reasoning behind this is that Mercedes would rather win a few races this year, even if it is with a customer team, than not win at all. Rapid Rumours Mercedes allegedly had a very long meeting after the Bahrain Grand Prix. Technical director Mike Elliott has supposedly been issued an ultimatum to make fundamental changes to the car to make it faster. Ferrari's head of vehicle concept David Sanchez has seemingly resigned. There are rumours that he'll be joining McLaren. McLaren are supposedly looking at signing an engine deal with Red Bull for 2026. Red Bull team principal Christian Horner addressed these rumours by stating as a power unit manufacturer for 2026, discussions are ongoing to be held regarding potential power unit supply. It's only natural that we would talk to potential customers. And retired F1 driver turned pundit Karun Chandok stated, I tell you who will be thinking about a move to Ferrari or Red Bull though is young Lando Norris. Would Mercedes really favour Fernando Alonso over Lewis Hamilton if Alonso is in a race-winning position and Lewis isn't? Head over to my community page to vote in the poll and let me know what you think in the comments. And if you liked this video, feel free to subscribe and check out my others for all the latest in the world of Formula 1.